realest Drop this and let the whole world feel it Let them feel it And I'm still in the murder business I can hold you down Like I'm giving lessons in physics Right, right, right. You should want a bad bitch like this huh? Drop it low and pick it up just like this Yeah Cup of Ace, cup of Goose, cup of Chris hey guys, And welcome back to the second video of my back to school series For back to school And the um Next video, I'm going to do a planner organization DIY slash tour of my planner video. And this is my planner. It's a five-star planner. And um, I, I like, DIY'd it like no other to make it more my style. Because I wanted, like, a more plain planner so I can DIY it. And first off, this is what the cover looks like. That's I just made, like, a little demonstration about, like, what the cover looks like. Because it has my name on it, so I don't really want to show that. I, you know my first name, Liam, but I don't want you guys to know my last name. And um, it just looks like this. Like, I did a yellow base, and I measured it, and then I put this. And then on the top, I did do a blue strip to write my name on there. I did it. I wrote it with my label maker. But I'm And then next, what I have, um, this is what I use to decorate my planner. Obviously, it looks pretty humongous. It's that width. So I'm probably going to need another one of these. It's just my pencil case that I used last year. And let's just um, tour in this. What I have in this bag. I have um, some Sharpies. And then I have um, another Sharpie. I love Sharpies. So that's why I have tons of Sharpies. I have um, not three markers. I have markers. But these are not all the markers I have. Um, this is just gray, orange, and green one. You'll see more in there. Next thing I have is tape because you obviously need tape to tape stuff in your planner and just you need tape and I need tape in my life. Next thing I have are a pencil and a pen. This is just a big ultra round stick grip pen. These are my favorite pens and it's just in green. And then I have a big pencil and I just have a pencil because if I like uh, to write stuff in my planner like if I need to erase it or not. Next I have a very dirty that is so the best eraser to use for like art and stuff so yeah it's very dirty but it's like a erase that you can like mold in the stuff and I just love these erasers so I have that next I have is a glue stick because obviously you need glue stuff in your planner three more markers a black one a purple one and another green one Broken pencil sharpener that cracked on the side and the like it breaks off this I really need to get a new sharpener because this is crappy ass sharpener like so crappy next thing I have is um, this brown marker I have um, just colored pencils highlighter pencil labels labels stick I don't know why that's in there more colored pencils a red pen and another pencil dry erase marker for my little dry erase thing in my notebook that I'll show you guys in a little bit uh, more markers, pen that's dried out, and more colored pencils, another eraser, tickets for something, I don't know why. A blue colored pencil. So that is everything I have in this little bag. A lot of stuff. Like, I keep a lot in there, and it's, like, very much. Then I use some other markers, too, that I bought. And then, let's get into the planner now. So, let's just open this up. And first thing you see is this little notepad that I made out of three sheets of paper and I folded it so you can write like notes or anything that I need to remember. I can glue stuff in here like recipes or anything. Then I have post-its as I label the label maker. These are two flag pages and these are two flag pages if I need to write anything down in them. These are some note cards that I cut out with the colored piece of paper that just if I need any notes or anything that I need to write down. And then I have a little um little message thing and if you guys didn't see my um my um DIY school supplies video then this is really cool you guys haven't seen it so I can write it on here and it's so cool so I just thought that really cool idea and then let's get here so these are it labels out in the month of the planner and I put label makers because I just love labels and I have nothing else to do but I kind of like it better with the white and I started to do this thing where like you color it with marker you look if you're gonna fade it and it looks really cool so I probably will do that with the rest of them since it's kind of like not much and then I have all the stuff that I need to write down in for the um 
dates to remember page it's like you have the month layout and there's important dates that I'll write my birthday labor day or anything in here this is a monthly layout that I write on all my YouTube stuff and this is where I'm going to write down all my YouTube stuff and then this is where I'm gonna bring this planner to school this is like my planner for YouTube and my life I'm gonna buy another planner for that or I'll just get the one at school not sure but uh, so yeah, that's how it looks. I have something to tell you. When I was putting on labels, I thought they weren't, like, sticky, so I glued them all on there, and then once I found out, like, the, la the last three ones, I saw that they were stickers, and I'm just, like, I'm stupid. I'm stupid, and I went back and unglued a whole of them, ripped off the thing, and got glue all over my hands, so that's why... I'm it's messy then you can write down any websites or blogs that people recommend to you and that is just mine so um favorites I have not written anything down because I got this planner out a while ago and then I have just like the regular things in the back you have conversions you have the periodic table which is that really cool because I'm learning about the periodic table in eighth grade then you just have um spelling tips these are like mostly misspelled words <sighs> That is that. And then what you have next is a, um, you have the state capitals, you have the name of the state, like their nickname, you have the date of statehood, and you have the largest city. There's like, I hear so many sirens here. I don't know why, but. And then you have the time zones of the country. And then you have the layout. And then at the last single page, I have just more post-it notes, the bigger post-it notes, the index card post-it notes, the regular post-it notes, and the smaller post-it notes that I'll probably just use for flags too. And that is my planner. Thank you guys so much for watching, and please give this video a thumbs up. Please go hit that subscribe button, and um, I will see you guys in the next video. It's like, obviously, you need to tape stuff in the planner uh, so next thing I have is tape because you obviously need it next thing I have is tape because you obviously need tape to tape stuff in your really I'm filming a video here you can shut up there's so many you really you really need to do this Okay, I think we're good. There's like, oh my god, my foot fell asleep. My foot fell asleep. My foot fell asleep. It, it, it. Oh, guys, don't know this. This actually helps your foot, like, have the blood flow through your um, foot again. So, you guys get a lazy foot. Just lay, just lay down on the floor and do this. Get your blood flowing through your feet again. So, that's a tip for you guys.